Hi guys, this is Neha and welcome back to Target Study YouTube channel. You have seen many of our videos on Master of Science with different specialization like MSc Biotechnology, MSc Information Technology, MSc Agriculture, MSc Geology, MSc Forensic Science, etc. etc. And today again in this video, I am here with one such specialization which is gaining its ground with the passing time and has become one of the most preferred MSc specialization amongst the science graduates of the stream. Don't waste your time in guessing my dear friends. I am talking about the course MSc Biochemistry. Yes, my dear friends, MSc Biochemistry is one of the widely taken master's degree in science specialization nowadays. In this video, I will be telling you about some of the most important aspects of the course, like what exactly MSc Biochemistry course is, what is the eligibility to join MSc Biochemistry, syllabus of MSc Biochemistry, some of the important colleges providing this course, its fee, career prospects and job profiles, and expected salary or pay packages after doing MSc Biochemistry and much more. To know all such things, keep watching this video till the end. So guys, let's start with a very basic question and that is, what exactly MSc Biochemistry course is? MSc in Biochemistry or Master of Science in Biochemistry is a two-year full-time postgraduate biochemistry science course that deals with the study and application of various chemical procedures in the living organism and their analysis including respiration, metabolism at a cellular level or a molecule level. It governs all living organisms and living processes. Much of biochemistry deals with the structures and functions of cellular components. The program aims to provide a sound understanding of every aspect of structure and function of living things at a molecular level to utilize the knowledge for the benefits of mankind. Now let's move forward towards the eligibility which is required to get admission in MSc Biochemistry. As far as educational qualification is concerned, the aspiring candidates must have completed their BSc in Life Sciences with subjects like Botany, Zoology and Chemistry etc preferably with 50% or more marks. Here I would like to inform you that some of the reputed institutes may give preference to candidates with degree of BSc honors in biochemistry. So it is always advisable to choose the relevant subjects right at the UG level if you have to make up your mind to join MSc Biochemistry thereafter. So guys, if you are eligible to join MSc Biochemistry, then you must be eager to know about the admission process to join this course. Various institutes follow any one of the two prevalent ways to provide admission to their MSc Biochemistry course. And the first process is direct admission. Under this process, admission to the course is provided to the candidates on the basis of merit form taking into consideration the mark secured in qualifying examination, that is, their bachelor's degree. This is widely used process, however, some of the reputed MSc Biochemistry Institutes, due to their higher demand, provide admission on their MSc Biochemistry program on the basis of rank secured in the MSc Biochemistry entrance exam. This exam may be conducted at institute level or state level by various governing bodies. Some of the important MSc Biochemistry entrance exam that you can take to get admission into course are PUCET-PG taken by Punjab University Chandigarh, GSAT, BHUPET taken by Banaras Hindu University, MET-JEE and AIMS Biochemistry Entrance Exam etc. Now let me tell you about some of the reputed institutes providing MSc Biochemistry course. So guys if you are looking for some of the most reputed government institutes providing MSc Biochemistry course then you can go for. Indian Institute of Science Bangalore, Punjab University Chandigarh, Aligarh Muslim University UP, BHU Varanasi, Andhra University Vishakhapatnam, and Cochin University of Science and Technology Cochin etc. And if you want to join some of the best private MSc Biochemistry colleges then you can go for Ferguson College, BFIT Group of Institute Dehradun, Mount Carmel College Bangalore, Jain University Bangalore, SRM University UP, Chandigarh University Mohali and MIT University Noida etc. Now you would like to know about the syllabus of MSc Biochemistry. The syllabus of two years MSc Biochemistry program is basically divided into four semesters. And in semester one, you study subjects like structure and function of biomolecules, cell biology and physiology, 
Enzymology, Bioenergetics and Intermediary Metabolism and Lab Course 1. In Semester 2, you will study Molecular Biology 1, Nutritional and Clinical Biochemistry, Plant Biochemistry, Biophysical and Biochemical Techniques, Lab Course 2 and Seminar. Whereas Semester 3 consists of subjects like Molecular Biology 2, Basic Biotechnology, Immunology, Introductory Microbiology, Lab Course 3 and Seminar. And in Semester 4, there are subjects like Biostatics and Research Documentation, Bioinformatics, Stem Cell and Reproduction, Lab Course 4 and Project Report. Here I would like to inform you that the subjects may differ a bit from institute to institute, but the course syllabus of the course will remain almost same across the institutes. Now let us talk about the fee structure of MSc Biochemistry course. The fee of the course varies greatly depending upon the genre and the reputation of the institution you are looking to join. Like if you are interested to join some government institute like Punjab University Chandigarh, then you may have to shell out something near 40 to 45,000 per year, whereas the fee for the same course in some reputed private institute like MIT, Noida, then you have to pay somewhere near 70,000 to rupees 1 lakh per year. As the fee varies greatly from institute to institute and from time to time, so it is always advisable to check the latest official notification before indulging into admission process of any university. Now you would like to know about the career aspects and job profiles after completing MSc Biochemistry. There are ample of job opportunities in diverse fields of science, education, marketing, engineering and alike. After successful completion of MSc Biochemistry course from a reputed institute where you can try to get placed. Once you are done with your degree, you can find employment in research laboratories, diagnostic centers, pharma companies, medical equipment manufacturing companies, healthcare centers and clinical laboratories and biotechnology firms etc. as a scientific writer, clinical trial and drug designer, technician, medical laboratory technician and business specialist bioscience etc. And if you are more inclined towards studies then you can go for higher degrees in the field like PhD and find employment in educational institutes and research centers as guest lecturer, assistant professor and researcher in national and international research labs etc. Now you must be thinking about the pay packages or salary that you can expect to get after your MSc Biochemistry course. Salaries and pay packages after MSc Biochemistry course differ greatly depending upon the post as well as the organization one joins. However, if we talk about a fresher getting some assisting job in a private organization, then he or she can expect to get something between 3 lakh to 3.6 lakh per annum. And if someone joined government sector on some gadget post, then he or she can expect to get something near rupees 7.6 lakh per annum with all the other perks and remuneration. Here I would like to inform you that with some on-job experience and acquired expertise, you can also earn this much and even more in private or corporate sector. So there is no upper limit of pay for deserving candidates in this field. So guys, if you have the ability to understand complex biological processes, have a full and critical understanding of relevant texts, or besides this, if you have understanding and familiar with assembling arguments, engaging in debates, critical analytical skills, independent thinking, and problem solving skills, then you can definitely go for this course. That's all from this video guys. I hope you find this video informative. If you also think so, please like and share this video with your friends, relatives and near and dear ones. And don't forget to subscribe to our the YouTube channel if you have not done it till now. See you in the next video. Till then stay tuned. Thank you for watching.